Let's take our Encanto characters and turn them into aqua beads. Today we're going to do Mirabelle, Louisa, and Isabella. Now there isn't an aqua bead kit for these characters, so I'm going to use my phone as a guide. So here is what I have. I've got Louisa, I've got Isabella, that one's my favorite, and Mirabelle with her green glasses. The Madrigal sisters are ready. I've got lots of fun aqua bead colors that we're gonna use. Let's take a look at all of these colors, whoa. And then I've got some tools. I usually use this tool to help me put all of these beads in our slots. Let's start with Mirabelle. So here's the picture of her. I'm gonna put all of the colors that I need in these slots. I need lots of black for her hair. And then her skin color is kind of like a darker orange. I'm gonna put these like neutral tone beads in there. Go ahead and shut that. We're gonna start with her hair. So let's turn it to the black color. I'm also gonna be using one of these cards just for a guide. And I'm gonna use this Tiana one. Let's just go ahead and slide that in. All right, Mirabel, let's transform you into an aqua bead character. I really hope the glasses are gonna turn out on this one. All right, perfect. Put that little piece in. Eye color, we're just gonna keep it black. Body color, just like this neutral. I need some white for her shirt. And then I could not find a turquoise aqua bead, so I'm just gonna use blue. Now for the earrings, I have these really awesome aqua beads. Her earrings are kind of like pom-poms. Look at how cool these look. They're gonna be perfect. Let me just put them right over here. That is awesome. Now Mirabelle's the bottom, she's got some pom-poms, so I'm gonna use a purple color. And these resemble pom-poms. Her shoes, she's got some pink sandals. All right, there is our Mirabelle. What do you guys think? Does she totally look like her? I think it really turned out. I love all the colors. Now we have to set it. So I have some water here. Let's go ahead and spray this one down. Put a lot of water in here. Make sure they really stick to each other. Okay, I just totally forgot her arms. Okay, perfect. I almost forgot those. Now she definitely looks like her aqua bead character. Let's go ahead and remove this one and let that dry and soak in. We're gonna do Isabella. So here is my pixelated image of her. I'm gonna go off of these colors. And this card is also gonna help me. I kind of want her hair maybe on the side like that since it's nice and long and she's got some flowers. So we're gonna use Rapunzel. Slide this in. It, she has very dark skin, so I'm gonna use this brown color for her skin tone. These aqua beads kind of look like flowers, so these are gonna go in her hair. Let's get started with her hair color, which is black. Now her skin tone. Her dress is very much a purple color, so we're gonna do the whole thing in purple with spots of flowers. Now I'm gonna do lots of fun flowers in her hair on top and on the bottom of her hair. Gorgeous. Okay, I'm not gonna put any flowers right here, so I'm just gonna put some more of her hair color. 
All right, you guys, what do you think? Does this totally match our Isabella doll? I think it really turned out. Now we're gonna go ahead and spray this down with water. Make sure all of the beads stick to each other. And now we're done with our second one. Our next doll is Louisa. And here's a pixelated picture to give us an idea. And the image I'm gonna use is probably gonna be Mulan since her dress isn't as poofy. So I'm gonna make her hair a lot shorter and maybe a little bun on top of there. Slide that in. So since her shirt is kind of like this very, very pastel purple, I have the exact same color right here. Let's add these to our tool. Let's go ahead and start with her hair color. Now on to her shirt. It's kind of like a pastel purple. Here is our Louisa doll as a custom bead figure. Okay, what do you think? I used the little red string and I put it in the middle too. Let's go ahead and spray her down with water. All right, now I'm gonna let all of these dolls dry and then we can take them out of their plates. Our aqua bead characters have completely dried. Louisa, we've got Isabella, which is my favorite. I love the long hair and the different colors for the flowers. This one's awesome too, Mirabel, and her green glasses, her earrings. I think these really turned out, even though we did not have an Encanto kit, you could always create a pixel image and go from there. I hope you guys all have a fabulous day, and of course, stay sweet.